moving fast over here. All right, so we're gonna be syllable stress. We're gonna look at numbers and ages. We're gonna try to we're gonna try to finish everything today, and I'm gonna help you with the midterm. That's the objective to finish everything today and uh, focus on the midterm. Okay, we already did this. We did this. La grabaciones. At this moment, do you have any questions about this information? All right. No. In this class, you will learn how to form WH questions with the B verb. In esta clase, ustedes aprenderán cómo formar preguntas interrogativas con el verbo ser o estar. All right. You'll learn how to form WH questions with B. The first thing that I would like to explain is the WH words. Whenever we say WH words, we refer to the following. Who? What? When? Where? How? Why? On your screen, you can see this words display. Let me write the rule to follow in order to form WH questions would be. You're going to have a WH word plus the verb to be plus some kind of pronoun or complement. Let's take a look at some of the examples on the screen. What's your name? And the answer for that type of question is, my name is Jill. Who's that? And the answer for that type of question is, he's my brother. Who are they? And the answer for that type of question is, they're my classmates. Where are you from? Ok, aquí lo que quiero que le pongan ojo es que we're not looking at yes, no questions, right? So this is different. It's not the same. It, in the last class, we were looking at uh, closed questions. For example, you said, you said, is your name, is your name, Peter, ¿cómo voy a responder este tipo de pregunta? Yes, I am. Is your name Peter? Yes, it is. It is. No, it isn't. Oh, no. It isn't, ¿verdad? No vamos a dar información. Pero si yo te pregunto, what is your name? What your name? That's different because there I'm not going to say yes or no. There I'm going to say my name, my name is, is uh, Ruben or Mr. King. Okay. So it's not the same thing. So I need everybody to, to pay attention to this section, please. The answer for that type of question is, I'm from Canada. How old is he? He's 21. Where are they from? They're from Rio. How are you today? I'm just fine. What's he like? He's very nice. What's Rio like? It's very beautiful. Now, it's your time to practice making some examples of your own. First, I would suggest for you to ask and answer those questions for yourself. And then, for your friends and relatives, remember, the more you practice, the easier this concept will become for you. Okay. So, I would like for you guys to, here at the bottom, we're going to write 
a couple of questions. I see that a lot of people did some questions. Uh, for this activity, I want you to write five questions, five with the responses. But this is going to be your homework because right now I'm just going to explain it to you. But your homework is going to be to write here, okay? You're going to write at least five uh, questions with what, where, when, how, why. Five questions with the answers. Okay, now for the knowledge check in this section, conversation number one, it says instructions. Complete the conversations with WH questions by selecting the correct question. Instrucciones. Completa las conversaciones con WH questions seleccionando la pregunta correcta. So, les voy a dar cinco minutos para que lo trabajemos juntos, five minutes, y después lo vamos a hacer todos juntos. Any questions at this moment? Does anybody have any questions at this moment? Somebody? Question, question, question? No, I mean, nothing. Okay, five minutes. Five minutes in pairs. <sighs> And then we are going to do it together as a group. Five minutes in pairs, please. Let's go. Hello, Jackie. Hola, Jackie. No entró con su pareja, Rosibel. Jackie, Rosibel hola. y Patricia. Hola, hola. ¿Me escucha? Oh, sí, no hola. me llegó la... Okay. Creo que le toqué. Ajá, ajá. Le toqué algo mal. Ok. Le voy a poner en el 2 con Karen y Karen. Ok. Tres punto ocho. Ah, es el tres punto diez, ¿verdad? Tres diez. Ok, ya lo encontré. Tenemos que hacer diez preguntas con el, con el question de, del, who, what, when, where, how, we. ¿Quién, dónde, eh? quién, dónde, cuándo, eh? Me imagino. Who, who es, ¿verdad, chica? Who. Yeah, who. Ajá. Utilizando ello tenemos. Me voy a disculpar que hoy no. Ok. Vamos a ver. How are you today? I'm fine. <laughs> what okay. what uh, El Salvador like? Uh, I like the beach. <laughs> okay. Eh, eh, no sé. Eh, vamos, vamos, otra pregunta. Who is eh... Ay, Dios mío. Ay, vamos a ver. Eh... Eh, como que todo se va en el momento, ¿verdad? Sí. When you... What, what, in your, what in your back? 
What? What's in your bag? ¿Cuándo regreso? Eh, no, ¿qué tienes en tu bolso? What's in your I'm bag? In my bag. Um, I, I have uh, makeup, my cell phone, my uh, pen, and my notebook. <laughs> okay, very good. <laughs> <laughs> Vamos a ver. Where are where are you house? Where are you? 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 My house this, no, this. My my house is uh -huh. Escalón. No sé si se dice así. <laughs> sí, yo sé. <laughs> no ¿Cuál, era, ¿Cuál era la pregunta? Uh, where are your house? Pero no sé si está bien. <laughs> ah, no, y sería Where is your house? O where do you live? ¿A dónde vives? Um, where do you live? Where do you live? Where do you live? Where do you live? Y mi respuesta es, Where do you I live? live? I live in eh, eh, Escalón. I live in Escalón. I live in Escalón. I live in Escalón. Okay. I live in Ciudad Merliot. I live in Ciudad Merliot. I live in. I live in. Where, where is your wallet? Wallet. Wallet. Wow. In my bag. Mm -hmm. okay. Hasta la otra has llegado. Ajá. Ok. Porque hay como un laboratorio que contestar todavía. Pero a veces no he llegado porque no, no entiendo. Uh -huh. Ah, vaya, chivo. Vale. Ah, pues yo voy uh -huh. así. Voy bien hasta ahorita. Bueno, voy con no, el no, mismo. No. Voy con el mismo de la clase, pero ajá. Como uh -huh. dijo Jimé. Como que no se acopla o amuelta lo que pide el teacher. Hello. Hola, profe. Hello. Pues estábamos, es, tenemos una duda. Sí. Va, este, teníamos una, una para la que nos está pidiendo. Es mm -hmm. who your friend. Mm -hmm. Y mm -hmm. para pe pedir, y, ajá, para cuando son varios es who are your friends. Algo así. No sé si estoy en lo correcto. Who are your friends o who is your friend. Singular o plural. Singular o plural. Este, eh, tenemos en, dudas en las dos. Para ah, plural, si es plural, es, es who are your friends. Pero Ajá. si es singular, who is your friend. Ahora sí, queremos poner, eh, digamos, eh, ¿quiénes son tus amigas en eh, femenino? Ah, es lo mismo, who are your friends. No cambia. No, who are your friends. Feminine and masculine, both. Ah, ok. Uh -huh. ah. 